Hello, my name is Virginia. I am a project manager at BAA. Thank you for joining this webinar. Typewriting training programs include 32 flight hours in a full flight simulator. During each session, pilots are taught not only how to operate an aircraft, but also how to deal with emergency situations and unusual settings. This time you will have a great opportunity to see and analyze lack of fuel situations. What are the main facts? What situations are the most common ones? And how they can be resolved? But firstly, let's start by revealing some interesting facts about jet fuel consumption. Do you know that Boeing 747 uses approximately one gallon of fuel every second? Short flights produce much higher emissions per mile or kilometer flown than longer flights do, because a large share of emission is produced at takeoff regardless the length of the flight. During takeoff, a jumbo jet can devour 2 million liters of air per second. In general, improvements in aircraft fuel efficiency are one of the most important designing parameters to aircraft designers and the market, because worldwide flights produce 676 million tons of CO2 in 2011. As you are already familiar with some of the facts about aviation fuel, let's move on to the cockpit where our student Boyla Sampranas will show you how to deal with lack of fuel situations. The first situation is about losing fuel from the left hand. So let's see how we will solve this problem. Look at this, it looks like we're losing fuel from the left fuel tank. Could you confirm that? Oh yes, absolutely. It looks like uh, either tank damage or engine fuel leak. I hope it's not fuel tank damage. Could it please courage uh, fuel leak engine section? Fuel leak engine section, that's right. For control. My controls or my communication. You have controls, you have communications. Fuel leak engine. A diversion may be needed. Yep. Main tank fuel pump switches all on. Crossfeed selector close. Closed. Center fuel pumps switches off. Record the main tank fuel quantities and the current time. It is 1620. And we have 3260 three, and 3940. Checked. An engine fuel leak is confirmed if one or both of the following are true. Confirmed. Fuel spray is observed. Uh, we cannot see it. Yes. And a change in fuel imbalance of 500 pounds within 30 minutes or less. More, even more. That is even more currently at almost 900 yes, almost one kilograms. kilograms. Choose one. Engine fuel leak is confirmed. Confirmed, definitely confirmed. Definitely step 11. The following steps shut down the engine to stop an engine fuel leak. The engine to be shut down is the engine on the side where the fuel quantity decreased faster. So that is engine number one. Yes. Yep. Auto throttle, disengage. Disengage. Thrust lever of the affected engine, close. Okay, so closing engine number one. Confirm. Closed. Engine start lever number one, cut off. Confirm? Confirmed number one, cut off. Engine is pulling down. Yes. Back switch affected side, left back off. And APU is not available for start as close. Yes. We are correct. above flight level 250. Autopilot off. Autopilot disconnect. Man of flight. Checked. Transponder mode selector. 
T8, T only. Minimal fuel, co fuel condition does not exist. Crossfeed selector goes to open. Fuel pump switches all on. Plan to land at the nearest suitable airport. I should probably call the ATC yes, now. Call the city, please. The emergency. Mayday, Mayday, Mayday. BA737 is at flight level 280. We have a fuel leak and engine shutdown. Request uh, descent and diversion to the nearest airfield. BA737, then heading 080 and stand by level 100. I will call you back. Roger, Mayday BA737, turning heading 080 and uh, descending flight level 100. Level change mode. Level change. Okay. And heading mode selector. Heading select. Thank you. That's it. Um, negative, we have a little bit more left. If wing anti ice is needed, we don't need it. No need it, definitely. And again, plan to land at the nearest suitable airport. Go to the one engine in operative landing checklist on page 726. Okay. The situation is successfully solved. Another situation appears due to unexpected damage in a fuel tank, which causes fuel misbalance. Let's watch it. Master caution fuel. Uh, Captain, we have uh, low pressure for the right fuel tank. Crossfit open and the right pumps off. Crossfit open and the right pumps go to off. Uh, it looks like we are basically empty on the right fuel tank. And it's reducing. Yeah, it's uh, reducing. So it, it could be a fuel tank damage on the right wing. Can you please courage uh, fuel pump low pressure? Okay, courage fuel pump low pressure. Impossible as well. Around 12.8. 12.8. Fuel pump low pressure. One main tank fuel pump low pressure light is illuminated. Main tank fuel pump switch affected pump off. off. Yes. They're both off. Okay. Next crossfeed selector is open. Center fuel pump switch. Uh, we don't have any fuel there. And fuel pump low pressure checklist is complete. Yes, it's complete now. Advice if you see when ready. Mayday, Mayday, Mayday. BA737 is at flight level 270. We have possible tank damage. Uh, request uh, diversion to the nearest airfield. BA737, just heading 080 and descent flight level 100. I will call you back in a few minutes. Turning right to heading 080 and descending flight level 100 BA737. Check heading mode and level change mode. Heading select and level, level change. change. Thank you. Man of flight, no control. Checked. It looks like our left wing is definitely heavier now. So we will need to apply a few corrections on ailerons and rudder. Checked. The final video we want to show you is about a fuel quantity indication system failure. Uh, Captain, I have done a uh, fuel calculation. I want to think that the indication uh, doesn't go with the fuel figure I got. Are you sure? Uh, Could you recalculate it? Maybe just a mistake? Oh, okay, I can try to recalculate it, but I don't know. Okay. And I think that, look at the indicators, they seem to be yeah, stuck. They're like frozen. Yes. Yeah. So maybe it's just an indication or gauge malfunction, you know. Uh, but uh, I don't anyway, even know. We're approaching our airport, so we can continue our approach. Okay. Because I guess we have plenty of fuel to make it. Uh, yes, we should. We should still land with uh, two and a half tons available. Oh, uh, okay, so we call it DC, please. We're ready for our last approach. Uh, 
737 miles out, uh, request descent for our LS approach. BA737, expect standard hold over Victor November Oscar, please 10 minutes. Standard hold over Victor November Oscar, BA737. BA737, you are cleared to enter standard hold over BA737 is cleared to enter standard holding over Victor November Oscar 6,000 feet. 6,000 feet. 6,000 and level change mode, please. Level change, speed 250. Thank you. And we have a hold here. Yes, hold over Victor November Oscar. Yeah, I hope we will be yet to continue approach soon because I don't like this mysterious situation with the fuel at all. I don't like it. Well, neither do I, but uh, according to my calculations, we can still easily hold for 20 minutes. Yeah, but we cannot risk it. Yeah. Yes. yes. We're lower, our consumption is higher. You know what? Ask please ATC for priority due to fuel because we cannot stay here any longer. Okay, we cannot risk. Uh, BA737, uh, request priority for landing. We have a problem with the fuel. Our fuel indicators are stuck and we are getting low. Roger that, sir. Left heading 200 to 2700 feet, QNH 1025. Expect ILS get to approach runway 02. Turn left heading 200, descend 2700 feet by QNH 1025. And we will be expecting category 2 approach runway 02. It will be A737. Thank you. QNH 1025. Approach checked. Yes, at last we will continue. Passing 6000 now. Yeah. Check. Lack of fuel situations are not the most pleasant ones to be dealt with while flying from point A to B. However, it can happen. And it's always better to be prepared and know how to deal with those situations. We hope that during our webinar you have learned something new. Thanks for watching and spending your time with us. Let's meet again in upcoming webinars. We have got more interesting topics prepared. Take care and bye.